An Oakland chef and 49er fan is still in a coma after being knocked out during last weekend's playoff game in Los Angeles. Daniel Luna's family says the doctors operated on the 40-year-old on Friday. KPIX 5's Betty Yu spoke with his family's attorney, who's calling for justice. Daniel Luna's attorney says that his parents and wife are at his bedside at a Los Angeles hospital where he remains in critical condition. The family wants to know why and how this assault happened. This is a beloved restaurateur, um, renowned for his rotisserie chicken, his generosity and, and kindness. The attorney for 40-year-old Daniel Luna says his family is focused on his recovery and holding all parties accountable. At the end of the day, we know there's a snapshot and some people have characterized what they are reporting to have seen in a videotape. I think that's not just only premature and probably inappropriate, it's also counterproductive. Earlier this week, Inglewood's mayor said investigators determined Luna was mingling with a group of mostly Niners fans when he allegedly shoved a man wearing a Rams jersey from behind. The whole encounter lasted about five seconds. The mayor has seen the video, but police are not releasing it at this time. The reality is, is that this was a one punch, one shove, two shove, one punch altercation. Uh, the greatest damage was done because he landed on the back of his head on the pavement. Friends of the well-known chef say such behavior is out of character. Attorney Jonathan Davis says there's likely much more to what happened than what was captured on camera. There's no question hours of videotape from a myriad of angles, right? This is, this is a sophisticated environment. It's a highly charged environment. So far, I will be preserving all the videotape so that that full picture can be uh, examined and uh, we can really understand not just the snapshot the moment but what happened before then that created the environment for this to uh, this tragic incident to occur. Inglewood police arrested 33 year old Brian Alexis Cifuentes for felony assault. He was released on $30,000 bail. In a statement, the family said in part, we want to make sure these NFL events are safe and secure for everyone and that all parties responsible for this tragic and violent attack will be held accountable so that something like this never happens again. It was private security guards that found Luna unconscious. Tonight, the family is asking anyone one with photos, videos, or details of any kind to contact the Inglewood Police Department. In San Francisco, Betty Yu, KPIX 5.